So it looks like a lot of commercial gyms are finally starting to put their foot down and having a no camera, no filming policy in all of their gyms. Let's get right into it. Some women on social media are upset after it's been found out LA Fitness is now banning people from recording individuals in the gym without their permission to combat this new trend of false accusations against men in the gym. So goofy alert. This all started when it became a trend where women on TikTok will record themselves at the gym. Then if a man pops up in the background, falsely accuse him of being a creep or stating that he was doing something he wasn't. Some women on social media are upset saying that this is stopping them from protecting themselves and sharing their stories of the gym when men they, or they feel like men are being creeps, which is complete cap. Because so far, all the videos that have exposed these so-called creeps have been exposed to be false. Not to mention, there's a reason why there's gym staff. Report the person to the gym staff. So LA Fitness has updated their new policy. Taking pictures of someone else without their permission will get you terminated for your membership and account contact with the law enforcement. The confusing part is people like to flex and record themselves when they do reps and people just walk by or, or whatever the freaking reason may be. So anyone at this point can be like, hey, why are you recording me, get an argument with you, delete the video or whatever, or get you kicked out. You know what I'm saying? Karens are going to have a blast using this shit now. But what's most interesting to see is not the women who are causing the most problems too. Some men in the gym can be a nuisance. We got Chance and Tyrone that's in the gym too, trying to film himself, trying to show off every little muscle. Or <laughs> Most gyms all across the world have a sign that says filming is prohibited. So if you got somebody butt naked, they're just trying to change their clothes. Would you want to be in somebody else's video? I'm sure you would not. Keep that in mind. When you're recording yourself in that locker room and somebody else is just trying to change their clothes, is it fair to them? It is a gym sin. And please try to be better about it. This is as disgusting as it gets. To record that video, to see that man in the background changing naked, and then you go and you post it. If you film your workouts, this is one thing that you never wanna happen. Listen, memberships can be costly. So when you're signing up, it doesn't hurt to ask what their filming policy is. A lot of gyms have this policy to provide their members with a comfortable environment for working out. Sadly, we had to get to a point where gyms have to ban phones from recording because of all the toxicity that's happening. You know, shaming of others and then posting it online. Thing that's preventing thousands and thousands of people from going to the gym because they don't wanna end up being the next online sensation. For me, I recently changed gyms and the first thing that I asked during my search process was if they're chill with me filming my work. Workout. If your gym doesn't like it and you already have a membership, you either deal with it or you find another gym that allows filming. The gym is a shared space. At the end of the day, we're all just there to work out. Props to her for being so cool about it. And the thing about it too, I think gyms have always had this policy like in their hand. But I remember signing up for a membership 10 years ago and they was talking about you can't be in there filming. The issue is no one at the front desk or any of the gym staff really checked anybody about it. They never really said anything to any of the gym goers about it. They just let people film thinking it wasn't a big deal until all this drama on social media blew it up and made it a real issue. I'm at the gym and they just called the cops on me. This is so unfair. They said that it's illegal for me to have the biggest ass they've ever seen. <laughs> I got a dump truck. And look at this dude here trying to explain why he got the cops called on him at Planet Fitness for making too much noise. This is getting out of hand. I got banned from Planet Fitness for being loud. I'm on my third set trying to push through. Uh. This. Those sounds right there is what got me banned. They said those sounds were obnoxiously loud, and I'm not allowed to grunt. They were telling me they heard those sounds all the way from inside the men's locker room, which is all the way on the other side of the gym. I'm just trying to push through my set man. They called the cops to have me criminally trespassed. I didn't know it was a crime to breathe through my set. I can see why some of you guys say it's better to work out at home. Look what I've on camera, y'all. 
and I had to turn the music off on this video, but look at this video here, guys. She's pretty much, she's making fun of the fact that this man is upset about her putting that camera on him. This this man is really being nice because I would have said some to her and be like, hey, could you point that camera somewhere? Else? Don't be putting me in the back of your camera shot so you can, can say all type of things about me online later. That's been the biggest problem right there with these women. They have no respect for the other people around them. Dude obviously don't want to be on camera. I understand why this man is so frustrated and shaking his head. Your camera is pointed directly at him where you're filming more of him than you're filming yourself in your video. That would upset anybody. Not to mention with all these cameras and tripods popping up in gyms all over the place, people are getting frustrated because they just want to go to the gym to work out. They don't want to be in the background of your video and they don't. So I don't think that filming in the gym is bad and let me explain why. I think that it has the potential to become bad and turn the gym environment into a very toxic environment. But I started recording in the gym to look at my form and to fix it where it needs to be fixed. And I know a lot of people do the same thing. That's why it's hard is because there are a lot of people who obviously do the same thing, but then they also create content for social media and have no issues doing so. And obviously I've recorded my workouts and I try and be as respectful as possible towards other people. My gym literally allows filming and there's one time that somebody asked me if I could stop recording and consider it done. I was done. No problem, phone and tripod away, all good. It was a very positive interaction. It's hard because I don't want to put the blame on anyone, but I'm just going to say it. There are people who are ruining filming in the gym for others because those people are the people that get mad when someone walks in front of their camera or looks at them or whatever. And it's tough because it's a very slippery slope and I don't think that there's a right answer to it because either way people are going to be upset but at the end of the day you have to protect the privacy of the majority and so if most people want to ban videoing in the gym then so be it if that makes people more comfortable then ban it i'm all for it i get why a lot of these box corporate gyms had to put a stop to people in their filming while people are working out but if they was truly smart business people, all they would have to do is just offer a, a private space for people to go over there and film themselves and you just upcharge them on their membership or for another fee to get in those private spaces and record yourself. And I actually thought to myself, why won't they have men only gyms? And I'm like, you know why we won't have men only gyms? Cause we like seeing these women in the gym. I don't, I don't know if a lot of guys go to the gym to see women, but I think a lot of guys don't mind seeing the women in the gym. We're not on no pervert mess. We just like cohabitation. I don't think I want to be in a men's only gym. I don't want to look at a bunch of other guys mugs. We're just talking about some of the bad gym girls who be in the gym just doing too much. But that's all I got in this video. You guys drop a comment down below and let me know what you guys think about gyms really starting to enforce the no filming policy and really starting to crack down on people in the gym with their phones and tripods out. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, like the video. I will see you in the next one.